If anyone finds this, leave it at my Gale's gravesite. I promise to a memento too. This inscription is extremely weathered. This is a description on a weapon known as Ohm's Wish, and it sparked quite a mystery when it first was revealed. Who is Gale, and where is her gravesite? As for where Gale is, that's a pretty simple question. Gale is in the air division of the Hive. Specifically, she's the boss of the air level. You can see her name here, Spirit of Gale. I think that the skull isn't quite working, because I'm pretty sure she usually has a different skin, but this is where she is in the game. Her spirit, at least. An extra thing of note is that in the Festival of the Blizzard, she appeared there as well, and with quite a bit of dialogue that I won't go over here right now. But that leaves a couple other questions. Where is her gravesite, and what happens if you bring Ohm's wish to it? Well, I can answer both of those. Some people think this floating island with these two graves near Jofash Docks is Gale's graveyard. However, this is not the case, though I will say that since it's not the case, it makes these two graves all the more interesting to me. The real location of Gale's graveyard? Gale's gravesite is inside this cave system at the back of the hive. Specifically, if you come through this cave entrance, really high up, at the coordinates 355 minus 5624, Y coordinate 114 by the way, and go in a somewhat straight line throughout the cave system, avoiding any mobs that come across your way, you will eventually, if you follow this route from the entrance of that cave, make it to the real Gale gravesite. So this is for sure Gale's gravesite. It's even marked with her name. So with all that said, what happens when you throw Ohm's wish on there? as the description of it asks you to. Well, that's when the truly sad part of this big secret reveals itself. Nothing happens. Because either you aren't really intended to get anything for beating the secret, or the secret is probably just incomplete, not quite finished by whoever put it here to start. So I suppose if it's the latter, I hope it gets completed soon. Anyway, this has been Duraface, and RIP Gail Nason, forever faithful. Have a good one.